our researchers work from coastal North Carolina to the coast in the Philippines. And it's important to really understand not only what's happening here in North Carolina, but what's happening across the world. We're working directly with our communities here in Dare County and from Dare County to Greenville. But we're also working with communities in West Africa and the Philippines. And, and that's really where our footprint is. First is very exciting. It's um, it's nerve-wracking. Uh, it's kind of scary, overwhelming. But it's something that like we have to do as the first gen. Like someone has to carry the family. Someone has to be the person to lead. ECU gave me that chance to be close to home, be around my people, and as well as get a great education. We're in a position where if we continue to recruit the talented students that we need to be able to grow our community, to be able to grow ECU, we're unstoppable. There's talent here, there's hope here, there's, there's a future here. Industry partners know this, and I think that as long as we continue to forge those relationships, we'll be able to, again, achieve our goal of regional transformation. Working at Brody and ECU Health have been amazing because we've really expanded our cancer services from here out into the region, growing small clinics so that people could get their care closer to home. We offer both the clinical care along with the academics and they dovetail together so well. ECU presents a unique value proposition, particularly through the VSIT program. We talk about ladder economics. We're created around economic mobility. That's where the VSIT program at ECU has been so unique because it provides that next spot, the, the continuation of a path or a ladder, as we like to say. And for students who may be more place bound uh, because they have family responsibilities or they have work responsibilities that are already here, they can keep moving up without moving away. And that's why ECU being here is so important to those students and to us at Wake Tech. I have probably looked for an online program with, that, that met a few criteria. Number one, it had to be affordable, so that's in-state. It had to be an accredited program. It had to fall within some engineering parameter. There's not a lot of schools in the Southeast that check off all those boxes. I saw ECU's program and yeah, send it. I, I haven't looked back since and uh, I I'm glad I made that decision. I have been really, really satisfied with all of the people that we're learning here. They really care. They really put you at ease. I've benefited from some of the newer techniques that they learned about. With my older dentists, they weren't up on the latest things. So they've saved a couple of teeth with new procedures. That was very exciting for me. 